This is a demo of my basic flashlight firmware for single channel lights that have only a power cycle switch in order to change modes. And I'm showing this in uh, this stainless steel S1 light, 10440 light, uh, with an XPE in there. So this is running on a PIC 10F322, which is a little tiny 6-pin PIC. And uh, the only other hardware in here, other than the decoupling cap and a resistor, is a AMC 7135 current regulator. So this is running at 350 milliamps max. So the default mode after reset is the user configurable brightness. And the uh, reset is fairly quick on mine. That's configurable by hardware, the combination of resistor and capacitor. And the light also knows that if you use it for more than half a second, you don't intend to go to the next mode. But if I double tap, now I've switched to the maximum mode, 100%. That's mode 2 of 3. And then a quick double tap from there, and I go to the third mode, which is this 1 hertz uh, beacon strobe. So there are only those three modes. And... Those timing limits make it tough to switch modes accidentally. So that's my primary goal here is use the mode you want in momentary or latched without it accidentally switching modes. And then the, if the battery goes below 3 volts, the light will gradually ramp the level down to 25% uh, anytime that it's over 25%. So that happens in both the user configurable mode and the maximum mode. And then the other feature that it has is you can set the first mode. So if you cycle through this quickly until it stops cycling, you can see it stops cycling, and I stay on there, now I've started the brightness ramp. And this will ramp the brightness up and down on a basic exponential curve. And if I find a level I want, I momentarily interrupt power on that. And now it's remembered. And that's, uh, that's permanently saved in non-volatile memory. So the next time I come on in my primary mode, that is remembered.